Yeah, no, Yuri Ange is looking tasty. We don't need to bring any snacks with us because we have Yuri Ange. Hi. His glow up, right? <laughs> you like Hostel? It's a campy slasher type horror, right? The gore is fine, but a slow burner. But it's like, it's not that it was too much gore. It's just that like the, you remember like get this Achilles heel getting slashed? I felt that. Oh, I felt that in my entire body. Yeah, he had a hood and goggles, but now he's a spicy boy. We love this. We stand this so much. What thinkest thou of mine appearance? Do you really want me to tell you, Yuri Wanshin? I love it. You look fantastic. 15 out of 10. Did you take up astrology? I want to say I didn't recognize you at first, Yuri Ange. Look how close we are. Come now, to scarce the first time thou hast beheld these fair features. Lest thou wonderest, I have taken up astrology. My present attire better, better suiteth the art. Though the night be lost behind the shroud of bl blinding light, doubt not but that the stars still shine. I have chosen to avail myself of their guidance that I might navigate the sea of uncertainty that stretcheth before us. But enough of myself. Let us speak now of our task. As I did mention, if we are to enter Le Lycia, we must needs gain the Pixies' cooperation. This is a simple matter of presenting unto them a suitable gift. I shall procure a selection of, vi of viands that shall please their palates. Thancred, pray assist me in this endeavor. Meanwhile, I bid thee obtain that which will please their eyes. In these parts, there abideth a vile kin known for its beauteous wings, the hawker. I shall lend thee a receptacle within thou, within which thou mayest capture a weakened specimen. What thinkest thou? <laughs> what thinkest thou? I will tell you what I thinkest, Yuri Ange. That reminds you of the House of Wax remake? 2000 era movies? They were. I don't know. I don't know. Would they still hit to this day, though? Is there a quest? Oh, is it out here? It's not that I have any room to pick up any more quests, so it's fine. Yeah. And a lot of people are just like, I just want to push through it. And I'm like, no, go, go and craft something or go and pick up a new class and take a little bit of time away from it. But definitely take your time with ARR. Tis done. The pixies shall be well pleased with these gifts. Ah, lest I forget. Yeah, I kind of pushed through it, and now I want to NG plus it, because I don't remember it. White Orosite, newly forged for thy use. What's Orosite? Our mission being to thwart a rejoining, we will most assuredly cross paths with those who crave the contrary, our eternal enemies. Thus did I choose to abide in this ether-rich land, the better to fashion a trap for the Asian's essence. Their essence? Their soul? Hi, Minfilia. Do you hate us? May I come in now? You may indeed, assuming you've finished. Why are you so mean to her, Thancred? I did as you asked. That's my girl. Thank you. I should probably explain. Though my body remained behind in the source, its limitations saw fit to accompany me, which is to say, I cannot manipulate ether. 
I took up the gun blade for its defensive advantages. But on account of my little impairment, I cannot imbue the ammunition myself. Luckily for me, Minfilia has quite a talent for it. Minfilia, once we set forth, we are not like to return for some while. If thou wouldst choose tomes to take with thee, let it be now. Really? May I? Of course, my dear. Yet have care thou dost not add overmuch to thy burden, lest I incur <laughs> thy great ire. Thou spoken to her of thine encounter with the Minfilia of Eld. Like the original Minfilia? Well, I suppose now is as good a time as any. As you know, I freed young Minfilia from captivity in Yungbor some three years past. Not long after, the two of us journeyed to the south of Armoreng. To the edge of the empty, where the flood was halted. It was there that she awakened. The Minfilia of old. My Minfilia. What must I do to bring you back? My dearest Thancred. Oh. As I am now, I am no different from an Asian. This child is but a vessel. Anfelia. One of many I have used that I might spread word of her enduring blessing and preserve the flame of hope. In my name, each has died, never having lived her own life. I have taken enough from these children. I will take no more. But what of your suffering, your sacrifice? This isn't fair. I will not stand for it. I cannot. There must be something we can do. Tell me. Should the day come when this child grows weary of fighting and wishes to cast it all aside, then shall I take up her burden. But should she wish instead to become the master of her own destiny, then shall I bequeath to her my all. Imbued with the strength that I reserve for rebirth, she may come to wield my powers as her own. And what of my wishes? What of Flamines? What, what of all the people who love and care for you and want nothing more than to see you again? I should go away? It is not their decision to make. It is hers. This child's, this Minfilia's. You have ever watched over me, Thancred. Cheese. Now I ask that you do the same for her. Protect her. Teach her. Stand by her as you stood by me. There is much and more she does not know. She needs a guide to show her the ways of the world. 
or she will never find her own path. When the time comes, you will find me here. Until that day. Minfilia, wait! What? What happened? You think he's major because he kind of resents her? And then she was gone. Minfilia, the girl, claims to have no recollection of any of it. I have told her many things, where we came from, what we fight for, but of that day, I have not spoken. Okay, how do we want this to end? With the coming of another possessed of the blessing of light, the first hath begun to rise up in defiance of its fate. The question remaineth, however, who shall take up the flame of hope which Minfilia hath borne for so long? Whether we will it or no, the choice must soon be made. Like Minfilia won't, won't rebirth, be like reborn? into another Menphilia? Like, this is the last Menphilia? I'm sorry I took so long. It was so hard to choose. In the end, I settled on just the one. That is well. Now, if all is in order, let us set forth for Lida Loran. All right. Let's go see these pitsies! Huh. We weren't expecting you all back so soon. We had scarcely been come playing with the twins. That said, your gifts are truly wonderful. Let me tell you, the milk and honey biscuits won't last a day, and the wings are the loveliest we've ever seen. Oh, I finally sold one. <gasps> nice! I sold three of them because it's for a quest. Somebody didn't want to make three maple shields. Three of them. That's all you had to make. You can buy the ingredients there. They bought my three maple shields. Nice! I don't- I just made a bunch of them. They don't sell for a lot. Okay. You've done us a great kindness, and it's fake custom to return the gesture. If you desire anything of us, you need but name it. Grilled rail. Purple carrot juice. Caramels. Ooh, I'll do the caramels. For the piety. Let's do that because we're gonna go in heels. We're gonna go in heels. This is pretty. So what is it that you desire? Rusty old coins like you mortals are wont to collect, perhaps? We are resolved to vanquish the Light Warden of this land. To that end, we desire entry to Liagia. Liagia. What a strange thing to wish for! You might as well ask for death! But if that is what you want, who are we to argue? Very well, I shall speak to the others. You might as well wish for death! You've clearly been busy, Yuri Would you be so kind to tell us what we've missed? 
You've clearly been busy, Yurian J. Astrologian and stuff. Astrologian in. So that was the purpose of the gifts. Is there anything you can tell us about this light warden? Aye, my lady. By circumstances most tragic, the light warden of this land is our king and ruler, Titania? He was not always so, of course. Our king fought the first light warden that threatened our home, you see. Fought it and won. But all the new horror, all the horrible light that came out went and corrupted them, turning them into a new light warden. Now their king only in name, not remains of the wise and just ruler that used to be. We had no choice but to seal them in the castle. This castle? The magic for breaking the seal we divided into four and wove each into a different relic to be kept apart until the time was right. And this dress is one of them. It's been in our safekeeping for years and years, but we've decided to entrust it to you. The dress? I'm putting, gonna put on a dress. Of course, custom demands it. Though you're most certainly, so, though you're most certainly going to your desk, we all thought we should at least let you try. That way, we get to watch what happens. Of course, you can't break the seal unless you have the other relics too. The shell crown is with Falth, the sewn scepter is with Numo, and the crystal shoes are with the Amaro. Good luck finding them all. The facts thus disclose confirm my own understanding. Our quest lieth now before us. First, let us hide to the lake, there to claim the shell crown from Falth. If we can call to them before the untouchable gate, they will answer. Look how pretty that is. That's so pretty. You hate people. <laughs> Uh, some people are just trolls, I think. Like the, like, Cerberus today. Cerberus today. Oh, yeah. Like Cerberus today. Like, what are you doing? I think people are just bored. <laughs> Not in a talkative mood, apparently. I'm not sure, exactly sure how the gate works. But if the food are water spirits, perhaps we should take our search into the lake. Uath? Oh, I, I suppose a brief dip wouldn't hurt. We all know Thancred swims like an eel, but what about you, Menthilia? I can swim well enough. Thancred taught me. You maxed out Carpenter? Is that what you've been doing all day? What about you, Yurianje? I'm not as sure I, I've ever asked. Rather than swim, mayhap it would be more expeditious to walk upon the surface by means of magic. Like Jesus? You too, Yurianje? That you should be a kindred spirit. Worry not, my friend. I know some helpful tricks, and I should be more than happy to share them with you. Together, we shall conquer the waves. Well, well, well. Aren't we a lively lot? And you have an entreaty for us, you say? An entreaty for mortals? What a treat! Yes, yes, yes. Aye, my comrades and I are on a quest to vanquish the Light Warden. To that end, we would humbly beg the loan of the Shell Crown, which we are given to understand is in the safekeeping of your people. Oh, is that all? Of course, of course. You may have it. You shall have it. Just like that? What do you want from us? Oh, 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 no need to be suspicious. The crown simply doesn't mean much to us, is all. As a matter of fact, nothing means much to us. For we fit, it's over before it's begun, and we couldn't care less what becomes of the fairy king, nor the world for that matter. 
Having said that, we do so seldom have portal visitors, and it would seem a shame not to make the most of you. Touch the untouchable gate and come hither to our domain, Domeg. In, our t in your tongue, it means forbidden realm. Sounds forbidding, yes? And so it should, for we are one with the water, our home wrought of ripples and waves and currents. Find your way through, give us thrilling sport, and we will give you the crown. Oh, nice. We'll do this and then I'll head out for the night. We'll do one, one more. We'll see what happens. Oh, this is so pretty. I love it already. Oh god, did I say that? Oh wow, cute. Water is love, life is drink. Oh, I was gonna eat one of these, one of these caramels. Nom 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 nom. Ice cream so good. You'll be an Omni Crafter, but you damn if you think I'll max out all the gatherers. But that's your overhead. That's your. Think of how much money you'd be saving if you just gathered it yourself. You're cut. You, listen, if you don't gather it yourself, you're cutting into your profits. Is all I'm saying. Oh, I forgot. What does this do again? You should make it. You should buy an ice cream maker for your home use have um i i don't know what it, it's called i have this is so pretty i have like emerald's pasta maker that and apparently it also makes like ice cream not a real ice cream i think you have to like put frozen things in there but It's probably 30%. Oh, you can't be bothered. Okay, that's fair. I'm just letting you know. That's what I look at. I was saying I'm frugal as fuck when I play this game. Not in the real world, though. Have a bad day? Go buy VR. That is my... That's my... That's me. My AI brain. <laughs>
If I want to max out my gatherers and supply you. Okay. I mean, I, I'm kind of working on everything, though. I want everything maxed out. I'm going to make me a house. The Lord of the Lingering Gaze. Look at it. I love him. What is this? Can I go over here? Don't be mad at me. I just want to see what it looks like. Oh, he's so cute. Are you going to kill me? Please don't kill me. I just want to look at how cute you are. Please. Please, you're so adorable and I love you. Be my friend. Oh, God. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, God. What am I doing? Oh god, what am I doing? I'm gonna follow you. Please don't kill me. I really just want to be your friend. Yukio, how are you? God bless it. God bless it. God bless it. God bless it. Oh. Oh, wow. That's really pretty. This era, this dungeon's so cute. I do this as a leveling dungeon over and over again for no reason. Wait, how do I get a blood lily? How do I get a blood lily? Look at that. <laughs> do you see how that tree walks? It's hilarious. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I was scratching my head. Give me a second. It's a ring. I thought that it was like a shirt or something.
forgot about divine venison. I do have divine venison. Answered, I'm daydreaming. I'm good. I'm good. We're finishing up the evening with our second dungeon in Stormblood. How's your day? I'm supposed to pick something up? Oh, we were supposed to pick something up, boys. Oh, boys, we were supposed to pick something up. Oh, God. All right, let's put this in. That is. You watched a movie with the doggos? What did you watch? Oh, hello. Oh. Oh, okay, you can attack it. I was like, how do I get out of this? Oh, shit. I don't know, am I supposed to pick something up? Oh, I'm supposed to be on, okay. Wait, okay, hold on. Oh, I just wanna get bigger, okay. Okay, I got bigger. They're fully grown? I'm not fully grown, what do I do? Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. We've done it. Ooh, trousers? Well, these are not bad. I mean, they're not good. Oh my god. I forgot that I didn't have that right now.
I forgot to put... These guys hit hard. They hit, I don't understand how they hit so hard. They look like, um... Oh, I was gonna say Genie from... From Aladdin, but then I was also... There's like a Futurama episode where people are water. Where like the whole kingdom is made of water. Water people. That's what they were remind me of. We get another one of these guys? Stop. I love him. Look at the eyes, the lashes on this guy. Oh, we're already in it. Well, you guys can just wait then. What? Oh, this is gonna suck. I'm the- you put platforming in this game? Hello? Fool's tumble. I'm so sorry, you want me to do what? I hate this, I hate this. I hate this. I hate this, thank you. Don't give commendation to that tank. Oh, because they started without me? Well, the only person left to give a commendation to is the Dragoon, I guess. And the amount of time it would have taken for them to lose the... Because they said that they didn't want to take the res because of... I asked him I didn't take the res and he was like, it doesn't take too long to walk back and he didn't want the... He didn't want the, uh... Like, the stat decrease. But I'm like, the amount of time it took for all of us to walk back, you wouldn't have had that stat decrease. Like, it took us, like, five minutes to get back to where we were. Maybe, like, three, but still. Like, if you would've just done that, we probably wouldn't have team-wiped. It just fucked it. It just screws me over when, like, my timing gets messed up like that. Like, I go on my way to Sipcast for you, and then you don't take the res. Is that when it turned into an imp because I, I got teleported right into imp choir? Oh, and then I was made into a toad. Right. TPS seed love. I love the boss though, even though he's a little, he's a, uh, he's, Kind of a, a dick.
I mean, I'll be the last one out, so I probably won't have to give commendation to anybody. Hi, TJ. How are you? What is this? Slaying. Enjoy my night of Final Fantasy. I am. It's been a ride so far. I think we've only done like two hours of MSQ. <laughs> How's your day? Are they done doing the... Are they done with the windows? Are these the... Are these the little water people? Jolly good show. Oh, you do not hold back. I love him. I I, I would want little no little way. one of him. Seldom have I enjoyed such sport. Look at the little. Come on, come we on. Thy demands. Will thou now satisfy ours? Of course. Of course. There it is. The relic you seek. Yours for the taking. Have care you do not break it, though, yes. He looks capable? Ah, but you, my friend. You are mighty indeed, and pleasing to the eye besides. Pleasing to the eye. He said I was cute. Oh, the frog said I was cute. Yes, yes, I could watch her forever. Why don't we just make her one of us? Oh no, things went badly. Okay, things went badly. One of us, one of us, one of us. One of us, one of us. What a fine idea. Why ever didn't I think of that? You may have the crown, but in exchange, we will have you. Uh, Faeul, Faeul, we need you. Faeul, please. Well, we live here now, I guess. Wake up! Wake up, damn you! One of us! One of us! Why are these pixies oh, so terrible to me? Ah, oh, you're alive. Oh, Bert. Thank the gods. I don't know where you learn to breathe underwater, but it's lucky you can. I'm sure you had your reasons. But the first rule of dealing with the Fwath is do not deal with the Fwath. It's said that they are born from the souls of the drowned. Were it not for your little trick, you'd have joined them. Oh, for breathing underwater? We learned that from the turtles. Back on dry land, in case you were wondering. They'll be searching for you, I expect. They tried to kill me! The frog, see, the froggies tried to kill me. Of the kingdom of Verba down there. 
I've seen better days. They were a stubborn lot, the Verbatites. The Verbatites. Set in their ways. But once you got to know them, you couldn't find a more welcoming people. It always froze over in winter, being up in the mountains. So we'd pull up our chairs, round the fire, and trade tales over steaming bowls of lamb stew, while the street lamps burned hot and bright outside. All dead and buried now. Them and anyone else who might remember. Everything we did. Everything we gave. What was it for? I wonder. I hope you'll have a better answer than this when all said and done. I like how it's still got a bloody... <laughs> this like the bloody weapon under here underwater. I guess he's a ghost though, right? He's just a spirit. Cause he's dead. Dead and gone. Oh, is this because of the black death rose? Black rose of death? Death rose black rose? Well, thank goodness they didn't know that I could breathe underwater. They still have a big window left in the living room. Are they still waking you up early, TJ? Hopefully that'll be done soon. It's been like days. It does look like you could punt him quite far. Well, now after that, now I want to kick him. I don't want him to be, I don't want to be his friend as much anymore. Beast Simulator is on sale on the eShop. Oh, Beast Simulator seems like a pretty good, a pretty good uh, Switch game. Bunny not meant to swim, so no. The fro yes, the frogs are drowned people's souls. So maybe people who drown are the frogs and that's why they're so, that's why they're so salty. Someone was trolling the entire raid? Really? What raid was it, Kay? Like, I feel like if it was Crystal Tower, it wouldn't be that bad. But if it was something, if it was something else, then that could be annoying. One of the near raids? I've never done them, but I've heard the mechanics are pretty intense. So if somebody's trolling, that's gotta suck. You bought a weird game called Paratropic? I'm going back in. Nay, my lady, exhausted as thou art, thou wouldst only endanger thyself. I prithee, rest a moment. I'm here, I'm fine. There was nothing where we looked. It's me! Hi, I can breathe underwater. The frogs, the turtles taught me that. Dear gods, were it not for Sorbonne's blessing, but I need not labor the point. I am glad to see you safe and well, my friend. Oh, it is Sorbonne. We forgot about Sorbonne. We were doing Sorbonne's quests, guys. And why are we doing MSQ? Have you any idea how worried we were to wash up on the shore only to find you weren't with us? Oh, but I'm forgetting. Here's your crown, your majesty. The Fulloth kept that part of the bargain at least. While there were certain twists and turns, our work here is done with everyone none the worse for wetness. Oh, thank goodness you're still here. Saloon, is something amiss? A greater big mo a great big mob of mortals is marching to Meg. Mortals with ugly weapons and uglier faces. They wouldn't happen to be your friends, would they? Rather the reverse, I fear. The Umoran army, at a guess. Meaning we can play with them? As much as you'd like. But just to be sure, I will return with you to confirm their identities. If they are who we suspect, we will require your aid. If Alpha Noah is coming, then Alice will be too, yes? Can't have one without the other, you know. Why are you yelling at him? All right, just remember, we're not your playmates this time.
I'm afraid we must leave the rest of the relic hunt in your hands. Don't worry. Indeed you have. Very well then. See you afterwards, my friends. Get, I don't know. I don't know anybody who wasn't here that didn't see Yuri Anjay, but Yuri Anjay is looking like a snack nowadays. Past yonder cliff lieth Pleiini, home of the new moo. New moo? New mo? New mo? The others have gone away to scout. Okay, they've gone ahead to scout the way. Let's follow. He's a snack for real, for real. He didn't used to be a snack. He used to just be Yuriange, but now he's a snack for real, for real. He is the, he's the snack I need. He's the snack I want. I don't know, whatever this is. But he's also not a bum girl. You were Googling rappers, Yuriange? Do you think that's a rap name? <laughs> if the, the path striketh thee as precipitous, Tis because it was once a mountain trail. For where the lake now lieth, there was a valley in whose midst thrived the city of Vober. It was only when the Fuath came in the wake of the flood that the settlement was drowned. We stand now upon its former outskirts, grazing lands where shepherds once tended their flock. Though one cannot help but feel a pang of loss when faced with such a spectacle, one can scarcely blame the Fey folk for so altering the land. This is Yuri Ange. <laughs> Men of search history be like Yuri Ange. <laughs> I blame for that lieth right with the light, a force terrible enough to bring an entire civilization to its knees, an entire world. That it should have been allowed to rise up unchecked is the greater regret. Yet, in spite of all the tragedy which surroundeth me, full glad am I for the chance to be here. Twas these hands which brought together the warriors of darkness and Menphilia, lest you forget. Therefore, even were there no eighth umbral calamity to forestall, it seemeth only right that I strive to deliver the first from its doom. Hi. Only right, I say, though such words I'll convey the strength of my resolve. In truth, I can no more ignore the plight of this world than I can choose to stop breathing. And thus do I labor for those we have lost, for those we can yet save. The coming struggle promiseth to test us to our limits, but so long as we stand together, I doubt not but that we shall prevail. Aha, mortals, just as we thought. These pixies. I'm sorry I can't do a Scottish accent for you guys. What ha hast thou business with us? Business? Ha! Nothing so boring. We smelled you coming and thought we'd come to play. We don't want to play anymore, pixies! <laughs> thou do not appear to be pixies of Lydia Loran. Mine apologies, but we're in some haste. May have another day. Oh, in some haste, are you? Then allow me to hasten you on your way. Tee hee hee. These pixies are dicks. Teleportation magic. For mercy, we were not sent far from our course. Should the pixies find us again, however, they will most assuredly repeat the trick. We have not the time to waste. Let us avail ourselves of an enchantment I have, I have learned. Fey cloak, tis called. A most ingenious magic which rendereth one invisible to fey folk, albeit briefly. I shall cast the enchantment upon thee. Under its aegis, thou art to make thy way past the pixies and rejoin our comrades. Know, however, that the enchantments shall suffice to veil thee and thee alone. Be not tempted to employ a mount, as it will only serve to give thy presence away. I'm not allowed to put- I'm not allowed to write a mount? Okay. Okay, you said to be swift. If 
Pixies leave, disappointment writ on their faces. Take that, Pixies. Oh, let's go see Daddy Thancred. Big boy Daddy Thancred. I assumed you were right behind us. What took you so long? Well, the Pixies, man. The, pic the Fae folk are assholes. I see. Yes, I'd say that's a valid excuse for lateness. You are hereby forgiven. In other good news, the new Mo village lies just through here. We'll enter as soon as Yurianje deigns to join us. An aetherite. The Fae folk like mushrooms a lot, huh? Are these them? Are they gonna try and kill me? That's the question. <gasps> Why are these guys so cute? It looks like a turtle without its shell. Ah, mortals! Mortals are here! Lots of them! Come back! Be my friend, please. I thought you said the Numo were man's best friend. The poor thing was beside itself with fear was beside itself, perhaps, but not with fear. This is unacceptable. Unacceptable, I tell you, to have so many mortals appear at once. It's more excitement than we can bear! They're so happy! Greetings, Elder Weed Eric. Ink? Ink? Turney? It hath been a while. Please forgive, forgive my brevity, but a time is against us. We are come to borrow the stone scepter of the Numo. The stone scepter? Then you mean to lift the seal over Lulaigia? This is unacceptable. Unacceptable, I tell you. If the king is set free, none here will be safe. Unlike our fake cousins, we Numo have called this land our home since time immemorial. Leaving is unthinkable. Thus did full many of us lay down our lives to seal away our king when they were corrupted by the light. If you do as if we do as you ask, our sacrifice would have been in vain. Uh, no one <laughs> just hand over the goddamn staff. Okay, no one will come to harm. Don't worry. Don't worry. Easily said for one who hasn't experienced the king's wrath. Honored elder. Please pray believe me when I say that this woman is possessed not only of the strength required to vanquish the king, but of something still more valuable, a means to resist the resultant corruption. Indeed, she hath already laid low the light warden of Lakeland, all without succumbing to the influence of its light. She is yet a stranger to this land, tis true, but she harboreth the selfsame desire to see the senators eliminated as we do. Will thou not lend us thy hand that we might see thy beloved home restored to its former glory? Hmm. You have always done right by us, Yuriange. If you have placed your faith in this woman, then so shall we. As you say, we want nothing more than to be rid of the Sin Eaters. Be that as it may, this is not a decision to be made lightly. We require time to deliberate. A turn of the moon, perhaps? Two weeks? We don't have a turn of the moon, unless we want to debate this with the Yomoran army. Elder, given all that is at stake, I cannot well expect these simply to roll over and acqui acquiesce to our request. But even now, a demon, a powerful foe draws near, and I fear I must beseech thee to hasten thy deliberations. The Bella, this is hanging from Bella, and I don't know where it came from. <laughs> we know full well that naught gives us greater pleasure than to render aid to men. Than for, to render aid to men. Leave it alone, please. You know full well, yet you speak the words of power regardless? It's unfair. Unfair, I tell you. What, roll over? Is that the words of power? I missed it. I was yelling at my dogs. In a happier time, it was our honor to assist mortals in need and receive rewards befitting our deeds. Since the kingdom of Obert fell, however, 
We've been starved of man's patronage. After so many years of deprivation, it is difficult to ignore such an earnest entity. Very well, Yuyangjie. I promise to give you as swift an answer as I may. In return, I ask that you and yours remain here the while and bestow upon us your patronage. Is this arrangement agreeable? Why does everybody want us to hang out? A visit to the new Mo. You're sniffing me? Sniffing me. You will offer your patronage to our people too, yes? Let's see. Perhaps you can begin with Marn Os. They were one of our foremost artisans, once held in the highest esteem by the Knights of Vobert. With the Knights gone, however, Marn Os has had no opportunity to put their skills to use. They would be overjoyed for your patronage. 1,182. 1,183. 1,184. Wait, did I already count that leaf? Wah! Who, what, where, wait, you're a mortal? Huzzah, huzzah! Well met, yes, very well met indeed. Have you tired, have you old and tired arms and armor that are threatening to fall apart at critical junctures in battle? If you answered yes, you've come to the right pneumo. I will restore your equipment to pristine condition for a payment of a pair of moss fungus legs. Moss fungi roam just outside the cave. Please, please, please give their legs and your patronage to me. Okay, so she wants me to get some legs. Okay. Oh, the moss fungus, the little cricket leg things. I love them. two moss funguses for their legs. Oh. Right. We can probably just teleport up there. Save us two minutes. brought you legs, you little cutie patoots. Oh, you are returned and with the moss fungus legs, I hope. Oh, I skipped. How many moss fungus legs will I give? I can choose. I'll give you one moss fungus leg. One, but I asked, oh, you asked for two. Oh my bad, okay, sorry, I'll give you two. Sure, no, no, oh, this wasn't the agreement. You think my work cheap? Well, then you will have cheap. Oh yes, I'll make a fine mess of everything you're wearing. Rip it to shreds. Hmm, wait, there are two legs here. Oh, you mustn't tease us fairies, so in my agitation, I could have done much worse than simply snap at you. <laughs> You see, for there to be honor in a task, you must perceive precisely what it is worth. Too little means you belittle our ability. Too much means you question our integrity. You've given me, f you've given me fitting payment, so my services are at your disposal. I should begin by inspecting your equipment. <laughs> okay, so we have to give them exactly what they want, or they will be exactly what they ask for. They will be very angry at me. Though I must ask for a small fee of the materials, I am pleased to say that all your arms and armor may be restored. If you mean to change them in the near future, however, there's no need to hurry. My first repair is complimentary. Here's the coin which you may pay me with when you desire to have work done. Many thanks for your patronage. But you're giving me coin? I don't think that's how business works.
Okay, dear. If you mean to offer your patronage to another, may I suggest he's goof yonder. Is he gonna yell at me too? Judging from your equipment, it's plain you're no stranger to battle. I believe he's goof will have something to offer you. He's goof slide up at the side of you. Okay. Ah, to have so many men visit us at once. This is a joyous day indeed. If it please you, please give me your patronage. As my patron, I ask that you remove the noxious mushrooms that grow in our cave. Flame spores, they're called. We would tend to them with magics, except they leave behind in a harmful ash. We have no choice but to pluck them one at a time. Now, you will be curious as to what I have to offer. I am a purveyor of wares that will aid you in your travels. In exchange for your fitting payment, I will give you my choicest items. They just want to trade. They just want to trade. There's nothing wrong with a little bit of trade. I have removed the flame spores. How very quick you are. Yeah. I wasn't spying on you or anything. I just finished my task and I should go and report back. Okie dokie. We took care of the spores. Oh dear, I believe I'm getting sentimental. Having a patron again, it reminds me of the old days. Fair every day I would carry my wares to the castle and offer to exchange for men's patronage. Like customers, is that what we want? Back then the castle wasn't called Legia. The Ver Vobertites built it and they named it Grunslicht. It was their last bastion in the struggle against Sin Eaters, and now they're gone, all of them, nobles and knights and common folk alike. But enough reminiscing, I must give you what you've earned. And if you desire anything else I possess, I would be glad to offer them to you for a fitting price, of course. Collected in place of Gil when using- oh, three free teleports? I guess. What do I do this for? What? You- you would be my patron? But I can't do anything for you. The lawless ones took my invisible ink, and without it I can't make my arcane wares. Who are the lawless ones? They're Numo, like us, except they've turned their back on our values. Curs without honor, they are. They refuse to work, instead spending all their time cavorting and making a nuisance of themselves. It was when I was outside for a walk that they set upon me and robbed me of my possessions. The ink included. I was too weak to resist them, but you, mortal, you look quite strong. You think you could get my ink back from those villains? If you do this, I will consider it your patronage, and by way of my service, I will make you something very special. Excuse me, Cory, but I couldn't help overhearing. If you mean to undertake this task, will you let me accompany you? Sure, Menphilia. I will learn from you, and help in, in what little way I can. She wants to talk to us, I think. She probably wants to have a secret conversation with us. You're welcome to join, though. Thank you so much. The lawless ones wake their lair to the south, inside a cave called Father College Chambers. They took many vials of ink, and I would be grateful if you could bring back as many as possible. Minfilia's got this. Father College Chambers is through here. I peered inside, and sure enough, it was milling with Nomu. They looked none too friendly. If Thancred were here, he'd tell me to go about it quietly and quickly. Let us split up. I'll find all the ink I can and come back outside. See you shortly. She's a ninja? What? She says stabbers? Oh, thank goodness. There you are. Those new Mo were rather frightening. I'm glad you're safe.
I see you use daggers. Sancred taught me, but I'm still a novice. The Minfilias before me battled Sin Eaters as part of the Yulmoran army. But that had all changed by the time I was found. They held me captive so that I wouldn't follow in the other's footsteps. I'd still be in my cell now had Thancred not spirited me away. When he found me, I knew nothing of the world. I didn't know how to live, let alone fight. Thancred once told me that if the efforts to summon you failed, it would fall to me to face the Light Wardens. Infilia? I realized oh. then that it was the only reason he kept me close. As a contingency. The truth is, he can't stand to be around me. See, she knows. She knows. We, we'll make it all still. I'm not his Minfilia. I said this yesterday. Once, we journeyed to Nabatharang together. To the place where the oracle appeared and stayed the flood. As we drew near, I felt as though I was fading away. I shut my eyes and covered my ears and then... And then... Uh, I'm not sure what happened after that. Because she doesn't remember. I a vague feeling that I said something to him. Only it wasn't me at all. It was her. Afterwards, Thancred didn't say a word. Only kept to himself and brooded. There's nothing I can do for him. Nothing I can offer but my presence. Though it only reminds him of his loss. She should be the one to live on. That's why I tried to find you. Because I knew that was what she wanted. I saw what she wanted, now though. You're here. I'm not entirely sure what it was she intended me to do. Was I meant to tell you something, or, or bring you to someone, or somewhere? I can feel the answer at the edge of my mind, just out of reach. Is that the Yumoran army? Oh no, it's from here. That light warden. Is that the light warden? Why? Why did you imprison us? Such boredom. Such tedium have we suffered. It is unfair. Unfair. She used to be a fae. Oh my god. <laughs> come. come and play with us. It came from the castle. When is it supposed to be a horror game? This is everything I have. Please see it delivered to the Numo. Where I'm are you going? going? To Thancred and the others. Oh. Well, I think Thancred needs to get over it. Minfilia doesn't want this for him. But he he won't get over her. And he needs to, because he's just hurting this little girl, and I feel like she wants to live. And she said if the girl wants to live, then then our Minfilia will let her go and live and give her all the knowledge, and she will be the Minfilia. Mercy, your majesty, we had no choice. Please forgive us. Oh, are you talking about? Oh, it's you, my, my ink. Were you able to retrieve it? Wait, was she talking about... Was she... 
Titania? Titania? Is that who that was? Haha, -ha, yes. This is the ink and almost all of it, too. When our king spoke to me, my day went from bad to worse, but thanks to you, it's simply bad again. What? You had the vision, too? Oh, woe is us. Ordinarily, when a living being turns into a sin eater, it loses everything about its mind that defined it. However, the king has retained some of other instincts. This manifests in the desire to play and be free. So strong is that desire, it often leaks through the seal to invade our consciousness. For a long time, we've ignored it, but we can't do so forever. But forgive me. I was going to thank you for reuniting me with my ink. You did exactly as I asked, so I will give you the service I promised. Ahem. Nothing up my sleeve, and voila! May it serve you well. Thank you.